here we go. Hello, everybody. Good evening. How are you? Hello, hello. Welcome. It's nice to have you one more time. Thank you. Are you ready for today's class? Yes. Thank you so much for being here. We're going to continue learning this thing that is called Learning English Pre-Intermediate Module Number One. Okay. We're going to have our class number four. Thank you so much for being here. Okay. Uh, let me see. Here we go. Okay. Thank you so much. We're working with section number two, as you may know, right? Section number two, how do you spend your day? Time expressions. We're going to work with those ones today. Yes, related to the simple present tense, okay? Just let me fix that one a little bit really quick. Oh, give me a minute. Oh, what is that one? Here we go. We're going to work with time expressions related to uh, the simple present. Okay, just give me a minute. I'm going to add that one. Simple present really quick. So we can have it clear. Time expressions about simple present tense. That's the one we're going to work on today's class. As you may know, this is section number two. And this is pre-intermediate module one, class number four. We have time expressions. This time expression goes related to simple present. What is simple present? Habits, routines, um, general truth, right? And the schedules. So thank you so much for being here. It's nice to have you. I hope everybody is okay, ready for this class and also ready for the weekend, right? The weekend is coming so you can rest and you can practice a little bit more of this thing that is called learning English, okay? So let's begin. We're gonna have this picture. How do you feel on the Chihuahua's scale? Mm -hmm. Tell me, you can like it's right in the chat or you can say here like with your mic, how do you feel like somehow based on the Chihuahua scale? Mm -hmm. How do you feel based on the Chihuahua scale? Mm -hmm. You can write it in the chat. Okay, the number, number one, number two, number three. Oh, look at number four. How do you feel, right? Number five. Oh, number six. Okay. Let me check the chat really quick. Okay, somebody's saying, oh, okay, Cynthia, very good, number three. Big say that number six, Jancy, number three. Okay, very good. Uh-huh. <laughs> number seven, Moises. That's <laughs> good. What about number eight? Number eight, <laughs> number nine. <laughs> okay. Yeah, sometimes we feel like this one, right? That's, that's normal. Okay, seven, lady. Oh, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> what about number six? Oh, number six is very good, right? This is like when we're practicing the exercise. Okay, Herman, thank you. Very good. Tell me, Her Herman, how do you feel on the Chihuahua's scale? Mm -hmm. How do you feel? Like number two? Like number three? Yeah. Oh, or like number five. Who knows, right? Yes. So uh, thank you so much for your participation of this one. Uh, we're going to have the next one, which is about guess the brand. Guess the brand. Okay, Cynthia, thank you so much. What's the brand here? Mm -hmm. What is the brand that we have here, people? Any idea? Karen, Betseida, Ingrid? What is the brand that we have here? Uh-huh. Anybody? iPhone. Oh, very good, Moises. We have an iPhone. Exactly, right? Expensive, by the way. Expensive. What about this one? Uh-huh. Guess the fruit. Guess the fruit. What is here? Mango. Exactly. Mango, right? Mango. And what about this one? Guess the game. Twitter. Oh, those. Oh, exactly. Angry Bird. 
Angry Bird, right? So we have Angry Bird, this popular game back in the days. Very good. We're going to watch this video related to at, in, and on. Time expressions. Let's take a look. Let's listen and watch. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to identify and use time expressions, such as prepositions and adverbs of time. Time expressions. I get up at 7 in the morning on weekdays. I go to bed around 10 in the evening on weeknights. I leave work early in the afternoon on weekends. I get home late at night on Fridays. I stay up until midnight on Saturdays. I wake up before noon on Sundays. I wake up afternoon on Sundays. Expressing clock time. Seven. Seven. Seven o'clock. Seven a.m. equals seven in the morning. Seven p.m. equals seven in the evening. Okay, so now let's talk about at, in, and on. At. This preposition of time is used to discuss an specific time, including exceptions such as night. Examples, we have classes at 8 p.m. We have classes at 8 at night. In, this preposition of time is used to discuss general times of day except night, months, and years. Examples, we have classes in the morning. My graduation is in June. I went to Mexico in 1989. On. This preposition of time is used to discuss certain days of the week or portions of days of the week, a specific dates. Examples, we will meet on Friday. I rest on weekends. Christmas is on December 25th. Sorry. So here we have the time expressions. If you see, here we have a list of simple present, okay? So you say, I get up, I leave work, I go to bed, I get home, I stay up, I exercise, I wake up. So these are routines, right? Things that we usually do every day. Every day, you go to bed. Every day, you wake up. Every day, you get up. So all of these ones are daily routine. And we use the expressions, oh, I'm sorry, the time expressions here. At goes with time. At seven, at eight. Okay, also at goes with this word, night. Okay, so at night, and also with a specific time, yes? So you can say, I have dinner at 7 p.m. I go to bed at 11 p.m., yes? So at, we're gonna use with these two, a specific time, and also with this word, night, at night. We have also the expression early, early. What is the meaning of early? Mm -hmm. Temprano. Exactly, right? So I leave work early, okay? <laughs> Let us quit that, right? Okay, so, <laughs> but you don't care. So you don't care, okay, thank you. So I leave, I leave work early. Early is like, and, mire, vamos a utilizar in, 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 con, parts of the day, but just three parts, just three parts, morning, afternoon, evening, yes, right, so when we think of parts of the day, we are going to, are going to use in, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, pero que pasa cuando ocupe night, that one not, right, voy con at night, at night, very good. Then we have around. What is the meaning of around? Mm -hmm. Around. Around seven, right? Around. Excuse me? 
Alrededor de. Exactly, right. Cerca de las siete. We see it in Spanish, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Exactly. Very good. Yes. So, very good. Late. What is the meaning of late? Late is the opposite of early. It's the opposite, right? Early. Exactly. Very good. Right. Late. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we get late. Yeah. That's normal. Until. 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 What is the meaning of until? Hasta. Exactly right. Until noon. Until midnight. Yes. Until is hasta, right? We use that one. Very good. Before. Before. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay. Before. What is before? Mm -hmm. Before. Of this one. Before. What is the meaning of before? Antes. Exactly. Yes. Right. No, antes. Antes, right? Before you leave. Right? Sometimes at work, not this, right? Mira, I need this report before you leave. Antes. Yes, que te vayas, right? I need, I need this report before before you leave. Yes? Before you leave. Okay? Yes? And then we have after. <laughs> after. Okay. What is the meaning of after? Después. Exactly. No, it's a laughter party, right? That, that's something else, right? That's something else. So it's después, right? Yeah, after. Yes, after. Very good. Mm -hmm. And, mire, tenemos on, 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 que lo vamos a ocupar con días, right? On Fridays, on Saturdays, on Sunday. Y también on, lo vamos a ocupar con, sí, mire, weekends. Weeknights and weekdays. Okay. Yes. ¿Qué son weekdays? What are those? Uh huh. Weekdays. Mm, yes, but how many days? How many days? Seven. Uh, no, I'm sorry. Seven. Five. Seven. Weekdays in Spanish le llamamos días hábiles. Uh, mm -hmm. So how many days? How many days? Seven or five? Seven five. Or, or, or five? Seven or five? Five. <laughs> five. Okay, Sandra, can you tell me those days, please? Five days? Weekdays, Sandra Marisa. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me those five weekdays. Um, Monday. Wednesday. Tuesday. Wednesday. 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 Thursday. Friday. And Friday. Friday. Very good. Friday. Esos son los weekdays. ¿Qué son weekdays, Sandra Marisa? Yes. Yeah. Bye. Días hábiles, right? Días hábiles. That's the way they call it. Los weekdays son los días hábiles, right? That, that we have uh, in Spanish. In English, we call them weekdays. Uh, then we have Thursdays, okay? What about weeknights? What are those? <laughs> what is the meaning of weeknights? Any idea? What is the meaning of weeknights? Any idea? Mm -hmm. What about weeknights? What is that? Fines de semana. Mm, no, I'm sorry. Es lo contrario. Noches. Noches. Exactly, right. So, son noches, right? Pero, pues, es, son durante los días de semana, los días de los weekdays. Durante Monday through Friday. Yes. Entonces, a eso le llamamos weeknights. A, los, a las noches que son, pues, de lunes a Friday. Monday through Friday. Yes. Como entre semana. Exactly. Very good. Mm -hmm. Yes. Very good. 
and weekend, as uh, you may know, weekend. How many days do we have in the weekend? Mm -hmm. Moises, yeah, tell me. Month. Exactly right. What are those days? Saturday, Saturday and Sunday. Very good. Exactly. Saturday and Sunday. That is correct. Right. So one more time. One more time. Utilizamos in with parts of the day. How many? Three. In the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. Utilizo at with at night and also with a specific time. Yes, a specific time. And on, boy, with a days of the week, weekdays, weeknights, and also weekends. Yep. Okay. Any question about this? Any question um, about se utilizaría para lo, cada día de la semana. Yes, that is correct. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Page now, let's have, you got this one. Use in with in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. Use at with night. He goes to school in the afternoon and works at night. Okay. But on Friday now. Okay. Use at with club time. She gets up at seven. Use on with days. He gets up early on weekdays. She has classes. I'm sorry, class on Mondays. Okay. So this pretty much is telling us the information I was talking before. We're going to have this information. Let's take a look of this one. Okay. Complete the conversation with the time expression from the box. You can use some words more than one. So that means that as uh, some of them, la vamos a utilizar más de una vez, right? More than once. Okay. So how's your new job? I love it. But the hours are difficult. I start work. What is What is the next one? At. at at very good so i start work at 6 30 again and i work at because mm. this is i start at 6 30 and i work on uh no i start until. Until. until until exactly yeah, right. Very good. Yeah, until yeah. yes until. until right sí que aquí está un specific time pero el context is quite different it's a poquito different right so that's why i need to use until yeah porque llego hasta las three right that's a lot of time and that's heavy okay what about the next one that's interesting i work the same hours but i work at night. At night, at exactly. Night. I work at night. I start. Early? No, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Any other action? Uh huh. Yes. Any other option? Tell me. At oh yes, correct. At six thirty, and then we have the the evening. What is this one? Uh huh. In. Oh, perfect. In, In the evening, and finish. Until until very good. Until what is next? In the morning. In the morning. Perfect. In the morning. Early in the morning. Wow. What time do you get up? Well. I get home at 
Exactly right. At 4.30 and go to bed. At. Okay, very good. And I sleep. At. Hmm. Early? Um, no. Early? No, I don't think so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, I get up at 4.30 and go to bed at 5.30. I sleep. Ah. Uh, no, I'm sorry. Because it's the sequence, right? That's why. Until? Oh, very good. Until? Yes. So, uh, until two. But I only work. On? Oh, very good. On a weekend. So, it's okay. What about you? Oh. I work. Um. On Monday. Thank you. Wednesday and Friday. I get up. Early. Early. Oh, very good. Early, right? Early. Early, Early around 5 a.m. Yeah. Any question about this? No questions? Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you. Erika, you are going to be letter A. Thank you so much. Uh, Ingrid, Stephanie Sosa, you are going to be letter B. Ready? Let's begin. Excuse me, Erika? Perdón. Okay. That's okay, the problem. <laughs> <laughs> Yo bien emocionada hablando. <laughs> How's your new job? I love it, but the hours are difficult. I start work at 6 30 a.m. and I work until 3 30. That's interesting. I work the same uh, hours, but I work at night. I start at 6.30 in the evening and finish until 3.30 in the morning. Whoa, what time do you get up? Erika? Hello. Hello, Erika. I think we lost her. Yeah, I think she was having problems with her mic because I didn't hear that anymore. Okay. Uh, please be say that carry on. You're going to work here. Uh, well, let's say that. Can you please carry on? Let's say that Yasmin Berrios. Hola, perdón, me sacó el, el internet. A mí oh, también. Erika. Erika, ok, sí. Erika. Thank you, I'm Yo sorry. Yo no escuché tampoco, teacher. ¿Cuál me That, toca a mí? That's ok, Porque Beseida. Sacó... I'm sorry. Don't worry, ok? Sí, gracias. Give me a minute. Thank you. Erika, continue. Ok. Me quedé... Um... La compañera iba a leer la B, donde dice wow. Oh, she did it. She did it. She ah, did okay. it. Okay. Well. Well, I get get home at 4.30 and go to bed at 5.30 and I sleep until 
too, but I only work on weekends, so it's okay. What about you? Oh, I work on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and I get up early around 5 a.m. Thank you so much. Very good, the two of you. Perfect. Thank you. But say that you're going to be letter B, Bexeda. Jasmine. And okay. let me see. Karen, Stephanie, Carvajal, you're going to be letter A. Ready? Let's begin. How is new hub? I know it, but the hours are difficult. I start work at 6 30 a.m. and I work until 3 30. That's interesting. I wore the sign hall, but I work at 9. I start at 6 30 in the evening and finish until 3 30 in the morning. Whoa. What sign do you get get up? Well, I get home at 40 and go to bed at 5 30 and I sleep until uh, two o'clock. <laughs> but I only work on wet weekend wet weekend. <laughs> so it's okay. What about you? Oh, I work on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I get up early, around 5 a.m. Thank you so much. That was very good. Yeah, very good. Any question about this? Do you have any question about it? No questions? Let me see. What's, what, what time is it, lady? Lady Evelyn, what time is it? Do you hear me, lady? No? Um, um, uh, 9.28. Oh, that's very good. Night, now, 9.29 now, right? Yeah, 9.29 is, is, is change. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay, okay. I'm gonna take the attendance. So when you hear your name, please say I'm here or please send. Yes. Let's give me a minute because I have it here. Okay, I think it's this one. Okay, here we go. Um, Ana Maria Emily Guevara. Present, teacher. Thank you so much. Good evening. Arely mm -hmm. Janeth Cornejo Rivas. Present, teacher. Thank you. Good evening. Nice to have you. Let's say that Yasmin Berrios Menjivar. I'm here. Wonderful. Welcome. Nice to have you. Brenda Cecilia Mejia Ayala. I'm here. Wonderful. Welcome. Good evening. Uh, Cynthia Rachel Bonilla Valiente. Hello, Cynthia. Are you here? Oh, yes, Cynthia. Thank you so yes, much. Trivia. Yes, thank you. That's very nice of you. Nice to have you. Elizabeth Yasmin Cañas Alvarenga. Present. Thank you. Good evening. Um, Erika Lisset Garcia Costa. Present. Thank you. Nice to have you. Germán Ulises Pinto Sánchez. Hello, Germán Ulises Pinto Sánchez. Oh, let me check. Okie dokie. Let me see if we have Germán. No, no, he isn't. Okay. Excuse me. Present. Oh, okay. oh, oh thank you, Germán. Thank you. Nice to have you. Good evening. Welcome. Uh, Griselda Saray Lara Menjibar. Present. 
Thank you. Good evening. Hector Enrique Guzman Alvarado. Present teacher. Thank you. Nice to have you. Ingrid Stephanie Sosa Deras. Present. Welcome. Nice to have you. Jacqueline Andrea Orellana Caldames. Jacqueline, are you here? Let me see, Jacqueline. Okay, no, I don't see Jacqueline, okay. So maybe she isn't, so no, she isn't. Thank you, Jessica Maria Molina de Olmedo. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Juan Carlos Escobar Valle. Juan Carlos, Present. thank you so much. Nice to have you, welcome. Okay, okay. Uh, Judith del Carmen Alfaro Rodriguez. Present teacher. Thank you so much and welcome. Nice to have you. Karen Stephanie Carvajal Rivas. Present. Thank you and good evening. Nice to have you. Lady Evelyn Guerrero Perez. Present teacher. Thank you and welcome. Luis Ernesto Garcia Fuentes. Luis, are you here? Let me check if we have Luis. Luis, Luis. Hello, Luis. No? Luis, are you here? No. Okay, so Luis, he is. Thank you. What about you, Moises? I'm Moises here. Elias Martinez Flores. Thank you so much. Nice to have you one more time. Um, Roxana Janira de La Paz Artola de Funes. Roxana, are you here? Well, let me check if we have Roxana here. Uh, no, she isn't, I guess. Right? No? Okay. No, she isn't. Thank you so much. Um, what about um, Sandra Marixa Valien Violantes de Arevalo? Present. Thank you. And good evening. Silvia Bexali Manzanares Rivas. Silvia, no, she isn't. Thank you. Jancy Stephanie Alvarado de Escalante. I'm here. Wonderful. Good evening. <laughs> and Jessica del Carmen Rivas Andino. Jessica, are you here? Let me check the chat on soon, really quick. Uh, okay, Silvia. Okay, let me check that, Silvia, really quick. Okay, thank you so much. Okay. Uh, Okay, uh, let me see, Hector, okay, Hector. Thank you so much. Okie dokie, thank you so much. Let me see, I have some questions for you that we're gonna practice here, okay? So let's take a look at these questions, people. Answer the following questions. We have A questions. Which days do you get up early or late? Okay. What's something you do in the morning? What's something you do before English class? What's something you do on Saturday evenings? Which days do you stay up late which days do you go to bed early what do you do after dinner on weeknights what do you do after lunch and weekends do you understand the questions do you understand the questions here mm -hmm. entienden las questions yeah all of them teacher what is yep. the meaning the which Number, wait, what is the number? And which in Spanish? Oh, which? Okay. Which? Very good. Okay, which? We use which. No sé si ven esto de acá. I'm going to write here. Which? Do you see this? Yes, do yeah. you see this? Okay, perfect, perfect. We use with which when we have options to pick. Yes? Auctions, okay. 
cuando no tenemos, nos tenemos algunas options que no son muchas, right? Entonces, for example, how many days do we have? How many days do we have? Days of the week. Uh -huh. How many days do, do we have? Seven. Oh, exactly. Tenemos solo seven. Hasta ahí es el límite, right? Entonces, esas son nuestras options. Por eso tengo, which days do you stay up late? Entonces, utilizo el which cuando tengo options to pick. Yeah. For example, aquí tengo los seven days of the week. Yes. Another example. Okay, let me give me a minute. Example. Okay. Uh, which uh, do you want? The red one or the blue one? Yes. So if you see here in the example, right, I have which do you want? Oh, I'm sorry, I have a comma here. I don't know why. Which one do you want? Which do you want? The red one or the blue one? Sí, ¿se acuerda Matrix the movie? Cuando le dan las two pills, tiene una red y una blue, right? Entonces, ¿sí? Which one do you want? The red one or the blue one? Solo le doy dos options, right? Ya no le doy más. Entonces, cuando yo tengo options, yo utilizo which one. Ahora, cuando yo tengo un montón de options, like 20, I don't know, 50, ahí puedo ocupar what. For example, what is your favorite color? Yes, tenemos a lot of colors, right? Entonces, yo le digo, oh, what is your favorite color? What is your favorite movie? Yes, what is your favorite team? What is your favorite, I don't know, book? Yes, but which is bastante cuando tenemos option, okay? Yes, uh, which do you uh, want, let's say, right? Okay. Um, uh, let me see. Which one do you want? A car or a plane toy? Yes. So here, which do you want? A car or a plane toy? Solo le doy two options, right? So, tiene que elegir entre esto. Okay? Yes? Right? So, uh, that is which. Y por eso tenemos aquí, which days do you go to bed early? Porque no los va a elegir todos, right? Entonces, usted va a elegir which. Maybe two, maybe three, I don't know, four, five. So, yes? Okay? Perfect. Great question. Another question? ¿Puedo hacerle una pregunta? Yes. Ese, ¿Cuál es la traducción de lo que el ejemplo que acaba de poner que puso which do you want? Red one o blue one. Eso no, no. Oh, en la primera. No entiendo el significado. Lo que usted acaba de poner ahorita de ejemplo, que lo borró. Oh, ok. Oh, ¿cuál, ¿Cuál te gustaría? ¿La de color azul o de color? Ajá, pero nunca había escuchado que dijeran. Bueno, no es que pueda hablar tampoco, va, pero... Sí, sí, <risa> which one do you want, the red one or the blue one? Sí, utilizamos uh -huh. ese one cuando queremos eh, indicar que solo es una cosa, ¿vale? Right? Sí, entonces aquí ocupé oh, the red one, el, el de color verde, perdón, a, a rojo, ok, <risa> or the blue one, el azul, yeah, ok, ajá. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, gracias. Perfect, perfect. Uh, so... Very good. Another question? Sandra, do you understand all these questions, Sandra? Marixa Violantes de Arevalo? No. ¿Entiende todas las questions? Yes. Sí. ¿Cuáles no entiende? Si no entiende something, avíseme. Let me know. Mm -hmm. Ok, so si usted se fija, mire, aquí tenemos, por ejemplo, la number 7 en la number 8 y also la number 2, la number 3 en la number 4. 
como tenemos un montón de options para contestar, por eso utilizamos what's something you do in the morning. As you may know, tenemos a lot of things to do in the morning. Entonces, por eso utilizo what. Yes. Ahora, cuando me refiero a los days, because I just have seven. Yes, I have a limit. Tengo un límite, right? Just seven. Entonces, ahí ocupo which days. Do you get up early? Are you ready for the questions? Ingrid, Stephanie, Sosa, are you ready? Yay, that's good, right? Okay, be ready. Okay, porque voy a start asking random people so you can answer this question. Let's begin with you, Germán Ulises Pinto. Hello, good evening. Welcome, how are you? Hello, Germán. Hello, hello. No, okay. What about Juan Carlos Escobar Valle? Hello, Juan Carlos. Good evening. Welcome. It's nice to have you one more time on this beautiful day, which is Thursday. I love Thursdays because to start this uh, Jueves de Amigos, right? Today's Thursday. Cynthia Rachel Bonilla. Hello. Good evening, Cynthia. How are you today? Are you happy? Yes. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let me see here. Okay, because they don't answer. I don't know why. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Elizabeth, Jasmine Cañas. Hello, Elizabeth. Hello. Thank How are you? I'm fine. Are you happy today? Yes. Oh, that's good. Thank you. Question number one. Which days do you get up early? Um, every day. <laughs> okay, so that means mon on Monday? Yes. What is next? No. Um, uh -huh. On Monday? ¿Qué día le sigue? What is next? Ah, uh, Tuesday. On Wednesday. Tuesday? Tuesday, Friday. Okay, you need to say on, on Tuesday. Tuesday. On Tuesday. On Tuesday, on Wednesday, on Thursday, Thursday on Friday, on Sunday. On Saturday? Saturday, on Sunday. Very good. Thank you so much. Very good. Ana Guevara, hello. Good evening. How are you, Ana? Fine, thank you. Sounds good. What is your favorite color? My favorite color is blue. Oh, very good. Question number one. Which days do you get up late? Late. Mire, tardecito. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Which days do you get up late, Ana? Um, días... Tarde, sí, sí sé que, que, que significa tarde. Oh, yes, ajá, uh -huh. days, days. Days. Ajá, uh -huh. días. You get los up. Días. Uh -huh. ah, los, los repito, sí. Eh, no, no, ¿qué días se levanta, right? Get up, late. Um, los días que me levanto temprano. Yes. No, no, mm. late, lo contrario. Lo contrario. Ah, ok, ok. Um, eh, Monday. On Monday. Repeat. Hola. On Monday. On Monday. Mm -hmm. So. Just, just, just Monday. Sí, yes. So, okay. So, so on, on Monday, you you get up late. On Monday. On, on Monday, you get up late. Okay, ahí ese you lo va a cambiar y va a decir I. I get I, up late. Okay, I one more time. Up. On Monday. On Monday. I. I, you get up. I, I get, get up. I get up late. late. Okay, one late. more time. On Monday, I, you get up. No, single late. you, single you. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, that's okay. On Monday, 
Um, I. I. Um, I did. That's okay. Okay. Yo lo digo y usted lo repite. On Monday, I get up late. On Monday, I get up late. Okay. One more time. On Monday, I get up late. Very good. Thank you so much. Wonderful. Thank you. Jessica Maria. Hello, Jessica. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. What is your favorite movie, Jessica? Mm, my favorite movie is Shrek. Oh, Shrek. One, two, or three? One. Oh, that's good. Thank you. Question number two. What's something you do in the morning? ¿Qué cosas hago por la mañana? Yes, no, very good. Mm -hmm. Solo one, just one. What is something you do in the morning? I take a shower. Very good. Thank you so much, Jessica. Great job. Thank you. Judith del Carmen Alfaro, good evening. Question number two, Judith. What's something you do in the morning? Um, okay. Yes, just one. one. Just one. One thing. Okay. Um, say, uh, I work. I working. Um, I work. No, just the first one. Just the first one. I work. I work. Very good. Thank you so much. Jancy Stephanie Alvarado. Hello. Good evening. Jancy Stephanie Alvarado. No. Okay. Let's good move with. Sorry, teacher. Good evening. I'm here. Now. Oh, thank you so much. Question number three. Number three. What's something you do before English class? Um, I sometimes. I uh, eat dinner. Oh, very good. Thank you um, so much. Okay. <laughs> but no, you want to say something else? Go ahead. Yes. Um, uh, uh, eat dinner or do the homework. Okay, or, very good. Or I watch TV. Oh, that's very good. So you watch TV. That's good. Thank you so much for sharing, Jancy. Thank you so much. Very good. Moises. Hello, Moises. Good evening. Question number four. Good evening. Question number mm -hmm. four. What's something you do on Saturday evenings? Mm. On Saturday, I do in my homework. I do my homework. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can you repeat that, please? On Sundays, Saturday, oh, Saturday, Saturday. <laughs> on Sundays, I doing my homework. Okay, just do. On Saturday, uh -huh. on Saturday evenings, I do my homework. I do my homework. Yeah. Mm -hmm. One more time, please. Thank you. On Saturday, I evenings. do. <laughs> on Saturday evening, I do my homework. Perfect. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Great job. Okay. Lady. Hello, lady. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Sounds good. The same question. Number four. What's something you do in on Saturday evenings? Um, no sé cómo decir este, darle desayuno al niño. Oh, how do, how do you say that in English? Alguien que le ayude uh, to a lady? Darle desayuno. Mm -hmm. al, al niño, right? You tell me, yes? Yes. Okay, somebody? Yes, teacher. Okay, please go ahead. Um, I give a, a, a breakfast to my child. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Also, you can say, I feed. Mm -hmm. Yes. I feed. I feed. Also, you can say, I prepare. I don't know. 
I'm sorry, I make, I make breakfast. I make break, I make mm -hmm. breakfast. Or also you can say I breakfast. Okay. okay. Very good. Okay. So lady, there you have it. Okay. There you have it, lady. Very good. Sandra Marixa. Hello, Sandra. Hello. Thank you. Question number five. Which days do you stay up late? Um, uh, do you understand the question? ¿Entiende la question? Sí. Uh, oh, yes, exactly. So, which days do you stay up late? Mm, so, how do you say todos los días? Sí. Oh, so so you you stay up every day. Oh, that's a lot of work. That's a lot of work. Oh. Thank you so much for sharing that. Sounds pretty difficult. And okay, yeah. so you, you're a tough girl, right? Because that's a lot of, that's a lot of. Okay, thank you so much. Very good. Karen Stephanie Carvajal, question number six. Which days do you go to bed early? Mm -hmm. um, I usually uh, Monday, Tuesday. Wednesday, <laughs> the the Monday after or until uh, Friday for the classes. Oh, okay. So early, right? Early, yes. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so that means you can say, oh, you can say, I usually go to bed <laughs> early to bed on. Early. And me dijo how many days? How many days, Karen? Yes, yes. Five days, uh, right? Yes. How do you say Friday. los los five days? Eso es de Monday through Friday. How do you say mm -hmm. that in English? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. 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 Yes. yes. Friday. Okay, yes. Ahora, yo lo quiero decir todo de un solo, sin mencionar lo ah, uno por uno. Yes. ¿Cómo, how, how do I say that? ¿Cómo digo eso? Um, right? No sé. Okay, Come somebody, on. somebody help her, please. Thank you. Weekday. Oh, very good. Weekdays. Okay. Uh, yeah. So you can say, Karen, uh, I I go to bed early on. On um, weekday. Very good. Okay, so one more time, please. Um, the the, the is... Yes, I go. <laughs> I go to bed. Early on weekday for the Perfect. class. Okay, very good. Thank you so mm -hmm. much. So it's like, me dijo, después de la clase, that's what you're saying? Ah, no. Bueno, ¿cómo sería por las clases? Eh, me suelo acostarte oh. en esos días. Oh, that's because. Because. Uh, because. Uh -huh. Because of. Because of class. Because I have class. O sea, el siguiente día usted tiene uh -huh. clases. Oh. Yes. Okay, so in ese contexto si tiene que largarlo un poquito because of the context, right? Because. Okay. Okay. Um... Excuse me. Okay, so you can say, oh, Jesus. Because I have, I'm sorry, okay? Okay, I'm sorry, I got it. Okay, because it says it, I have um, mm, Oh, I okay, I have uh, glasses. Oh, okay. I have glasses. Um, yep. Next day. Um, yeah. uh, because I have glasses, uh, let's say, um, uh, mm, this is the tomorrow, yeah. Oh, Wednesday because I have classes 
Um, yeah, I have but I have but like because I have class every day. Um, no. No, early in the morning, let's say. Early, yes. The next day. Early in the I'm... morning. Um in the morning. Okay. Oh Jesus. Yes. I think that sounds better, right? Yes. Because I have classes early in the morning. Yeah. Okay. And uh, as you may know, it's every out. day, every day, early in the morning, every day. Oh, because aquí lo tengo, yeah. Weekdays. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. <laughs> ya no lo necesito poner every day porque pues, ya lo tengo acá. Entonces, va en el context. You know what I mean? Yeah. So mm -hmm. if you say, oh, I go to bed early on weekdays because I have classes early in the morning. Okay, oh. yeah, like that, right, Karen? Okay. Um, <laughs> yes. <laughs> please, say it. Oh, Karen, say it, please. Oh, repeat uh... the sentence, okay? <laughs> Diga okay. la sentence. I go. I go to early. I did it, yes. I go to early in quit night. Quit day because I have classes early in the morning. Very good. Yes, very good. Thank you so much. There you go. Thank, Thank you. you. But say that question number seven. What do you do after? I'm sorry, after dinner on weeknights? Mm -hmm. Big Seda, number seven. I practice in the classroom. Classroom. Oh, very good. Very good. One more time, please. Um, oh, repeat, repeat. Okay. <laughs> I practiced in the classroom um, with me after dinner. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Yep. Very good. Ingrid Stephanie Sosa Deras. Hello. Good evening. Welcome. Tell me, what do you do after lunch on weekends? After lunch. ¿Qué, qué día almuerzo? No, no, what do you do? Que hace, right? After lunch. The lunch on yeah, well. weekends. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Ingrid, voy a pedirle a alguien más para que participe. Y you hear, escucha, right? Y luego you try to answer. Oh, Roxana, please. Okay. What do you do after lunch on weekends? Okay. I uh, walk. After lunch, I walk. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay. So, okay. lunch. What is lunch, Ingrid? Ingrid, Stephanie, what is lunch? It's lunch. Mm -hmm. What is lunch? Mm -hmm. Do you do you understand? Entiende qué significa lunch? Eh, almuerzo. Exactly right. Cuando on weekends. ¿Qué significa weekends? Eh, los días de la semana de lunes a viernes. No, fin de semana. Semana, fin de semana. Yes, very good. ¿Cuáles son esos días, Ingrid? Tell me, please. Sábado y domingo. Oh. <laughs> Ingrid, Ingrid, thank you. Tell me those two days. Eh, eh. I'm sleeping. I'm Ingrid. Saturday and Sunday. Very good. Exactly. Saturday and Sunday. Very good. So that's the weekend, right? Saturday and Sunday. Very good. So what do you do after lunch on weekends? Mm -hmm. Remember two days, right? Saturday and Sunday. So what do you do? Yes. Uh, what do you do? And Saturday, go to the uh, university. Oh, that's very good. And that's that's difficult, yeah. So you yeah. go to the university on Saturday. Oh, that's very good. What about on on Sunday? What do you and do? 
I do my homework. Oh, that's perfect. That's a good student, right? That's a good student. Very good. Thank you so much, Ingrid. Great job. Okay. So here we have a combination of everything. We have days of the week, right? Please do me a favor. Um, let me see. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Let me see the time. No, I'm sorry. Yeah. Before we go to bed, I'm sorry. Really quick. Uh, Moises, tell me days of the week, please. Days? Uh, days of the week. Week. Mm, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Beautiful. That is correct, right? So here we have Thank days you. of the week. And also we have what do we do? Yes. During weekdays, mm -hmm. what do we do on the weekend? If we get up early, if we go to bed late, okay, uh, what do you do before something or what do you do after something? This is about simple present. And again, practice, people. Practice every single day simple present because that's pan dulce with coffee. Every single day we have this one. Are you ready for the weekend, eh, Roxana? Yes. Yes, teacher. Oh, that's wonderful. People, enjoy your weekend. Be nice and be kind. And we will see you next class on Monday. Take teacher, care. Have a nice weekend. You do the same. Take care. Bye-bye. Good, Bye -bye. Good night, everybody. Happy weekend. Good night. You do Happy the same. Weekend. Enjoy your weekend, right? Thank you.